Fated to be loved by villains at face to face in Sarah's worldview exists the concept of perpetuity. If you go beyond a certain level in any field, you will be able to unite with the will that encompasses the world of course, it's hard and complicated, and thus the humans who manage to reach such eternity are given a kind of power as a reward, a power that can extend to the laws of nature that are beyond the interference of the human body. There were scattered anecdotes like legends about the first Archduke Tristan, who is considered one of the strongest knights of all time as a representative eternal, splitting time and space with his sword. It was said that no armor was useful against him, as he could cut through the very space itself with a single swing. That he could cut away the day turning the morning into evening that same person created the Tristan-style swordsmanship that I am using. It's a ridiculous story, hence why. It's just a legend with no indication of it actually happening, but that's probably not the case, considering the strength of the Eternal in front of me. It could be said that the story was handed down without exaggeration. A talent Swanson, an Eternal who was granted the power of immortality, shares famous not only in the Empire but throughout the continent. Oh, student, you're early. Early. However, such a legendary existence looks no different than a short girl, looking at the vitality flowing through her violet-colored hair and eyes. No one would be able to tell that this is a thousand-year-old monster student, yep. I hastily took my seat upon hearing that voice, thank you for accepting my sudden invitation, you must have been surprised. She had a kind tone and smile, probably to smoothen the conversation but I know what kind of person her talent is, despite having lived for a thousand years, she hates wasting time more than anyone else, if she decided to have a sit down with me, that means that she had an equally important business. Do you know why I called you here, Dud Campbell? I am uncertain, I have some bad news and even worse news, which one would you like to hear first? Why isn't there anything good? Let's start with the bad first. Hmm, student Dowd Campbell has already been involved in several incidents even before being assigned to a class. The president then put on a monocle and looked through some documents. Is there a record of my involvements? I didn't intentionally participate nor cause any of those incidents. That's what makes it jarring. In Elfant's long history, we've had all sorts of students, but I have never seen a student causing such a stir before their first class. After saying that, a talent let out a deep sigh, but it's also talent to always be able to get out of it, hey, is it? Why is this bad news? All she did was praise, to this, a talent replied with a smile, having bad luck means that you will be caught up in another incident in the future, so that's bad news. That I can't refute, and that misfortune leads to the worst news, a talent took off her monocle and rested her chin on her hands with a grin, student, by any chance or ever, Yes, how much do you know about the devil? The gaze that came with that sentence was not at all amused. A talent was interested to know what kind of person Dowd Campbell was. Despite knowing almost everything that happens within the academy, he was still a mystery, at least. His current look is implying that. Interesting reaction. Action. A talent smiled inwardly as she looked at Dowd Campbell, whose expression did not change despite saying such a sentence. Ordinary students would have been frozen just by the mere fact that they are alone with the president. They would feel intimidated just from the sheer difference in status. On the other hand, this man is not even nervous, despite the fact that the president herself brought up the ominous topic of the devil. His expression did not change, rather, he seemed to be in deep thought. It's like his considering what would be the best answer in the current situation, with this. His emergency response passed, as a seasoned veteran, she didn't need to think too hard when evaluating something. I don't think it's appropriate to tell about how much I know, but Dowd's answer was unexpected. Yes, I don't know what you're going to do with that information, a talent couldn't help but laugh, you don't like it. In fact, it's not hard to know that there's some plotting going on. It's already been shown several times, imagine, you still haven't been assigned to a class while all the other students already started with theirs, naturally, that would raise some suspicions, it's hard to like it knowing that I'm being manipulated, however. She didn't expect one of those specific means to be mentioned, a talent's eyes narrowed and asked back, what did you say, 
As you mentioned earlier, I have been involved in several larger scale cases, with so many eyes watching, there is bound to be rumours one way or another, Dowd Campbell calmly continued. The hegemonic powers are currently in the midst of chaos, it wouldn't be strange for numerous people to contact me at this time. Everyone is trying to reel in shining talents by hook or crook, indeed, there are such news all over, tribal unions cops hat, huge organizational changes in the Holy Land. Power struggle over the throne, ek, the continent was in turmoil, the same goes for the golden triangle, on the surface, they are good neighbors living in harmony and helping each other, but behind the scenes, they are engaged in a fierce competition to recruit the best talent, however, this is by no means something that a mere student can obtain, analyze, and logically infer information on their own, even more so if it was the son of a baron who did not have the right to access such advanced information, and yet, this man is casually talking about such things, like it was a natural thing, a talent smiled inwardly, however. There's nothing but crickets, all I can say is that someone is artificially suppressing information about me, or or, it's a step further and everyone is collectively pretending not to know, I don't why or how you would do that, if a talent didn't have a reputation to uphold, she would have stood up and began clapping like a seal, it was an accurate judgment, he was excellent at weighing information and situations, and filling in the gaps, political sense, also a pass in fact, Dad occupied an important position in future plans. A talent was worried if he was lacking in a lot of things, but now, she's not disappointed at least, no, rather, she was pleased that a jewel of this level was discovered among the students, it's probably because of her excitement from meeting a talent, but she unconsciously leaked things she shouldn't have at the current stage of the plan, first of all, I would like to apologize about controlling the information, but I want you to know that it is an essential part, is it a big deal if I stand out, yes, a talent continued with a smile on her face, the world will end.